Um, hi, welcome to my videos. I'm Jo Crane. I'm a consultant community pediatrician in Portsmouth. Um, hopefully you've already watched my video on the hand model and now also on what cortisol does to our brain. So um, I'm now going to move on to the hormone called oxytocin and how this works as well. So oxytocin is the hormone that we secrete when we feel uh, protected, when we feel, I call it the hug hormone. So if you give somebody a hug, that feeling that you get of protection is produced from oxytocin being released in your brain. And it full goes all over the brain actually, but the best effect it has is on your frontal lobe and it makes you feel calmer and it feel, makes you feel that you can manage um, what is happening. So what we're wanting to do with our children when they flip their lids is we're wanting to try and promote their brains to secrete oxytocin to help get that lid down. Because if you can get that lid down, you can start to grow those really healthy little pathways between your frontal lobe and your downstairs brain, okay? And that's what we're wanting to do. So oxytocin, so this is where, if people have met me, they'll know my rule of five positives. So the rule of five positives is about for every negative that you do, you need to do five positives. And so the idea is that you're asking, say, um, I use the example of um, you're taking your child from the swings. They do not want to go from the swings because they're having a great time. And the next video will talk about dopamine and what that's about. So they're having a great time. So you've been super calm parenting and said, right, we're going to go and count to count to 10 and we're removing it. So baby, you pull the child out of the swings, the swings, they are not happy. They flip their lid, they're screaming, their cortisol, because obviously you're trying to kill them, removing them from the swings as far as they are concerned. You know you're not, but they feel you are. So they flip their lid. So as a parent, what might happen actually is because we're tired, we're bored, and we've really been at the swings for far too long, what can happen sometimes is we go, oh, for goodness sake, please just, we're going, don't be so silly, and we relatively flip their lid with them. And then they continue screaming. Now, what we need to do, the rule of five positives is that for every negative, which is, I'm taking you away from the swings, I need to give you five positives to help you learn to get your lid down. So I'm taking you away from the swings, and we call it, we name it to tame it, which I'll talk about in another video. Um, you know, I know you're feeling sad. I know you're feeling cross. Okay. You can do this. You are brilliant. Fantastic. I know this is upsetting, but you are great. And what you're doing is you're showing the child, your child, that you get where they're coming from. And what that does is it connects the two sides of the brain, your left and your right brain. And what you're doing is you're making them start to secrete some oxytocin. And if you can secrete that, you can get your cortisol down. But you need more oxytocin, not one, to, not one to one. You need five lots to start to get that cortisol down so that the child can then get their lid down. Now, the actual experience might be that actually you have a screaming child all the way home and your lid is like this. Oh, forgive my plaster of crooked finger. And, and your lid is flipping as well so you need to do things to try and get your lid down because actually staying calm is absolutely key for helping your child learn to get their lid down now sometimes you say parents say to me well they, you know if i stay calm they just don't listen or um, you know they just ignore me but actually if you shout at them and scream at them even more they might go silent but what you've done is you fill them with more cortisol and you've pushed them from fight or flight into freeze. So they look like they've stopped for you, but they haven't stopped really, they've just frozen. You might feel, well, actually, I've still got the right result, but actually what you've done is you've just worsened the cortisol drive. And what we're wanting to do is get those lids down to get that oxytocin, because if you can get emotional regulation by doing this, it will have a massive effect long-term. Okay, I'm at four and a half minutes. I'm going to stop now. Thank you very much for listening.